little bit less direct in answers, um, which I mean, that, that goes with public speaking. Right. And public speaking wasn't mentioned here no. at all. Um, We both did, it was in, in the first in interview, the, yeah. and they both talked about their public speaking abilities and how they have grown as public speakers, um, and it's funny that you say that because after the first interview, people did not think Kimberly was a great public speaker. There was a lot of, after her first interview, mm -hmm. there was a lot of conversation about how mm -hmm. she, did, she did not present herself as she well, said she was like, working on it. She, she had taken a course. She had taken classes. And then tonight, I was like... She knocked it out of the park. I, yeah, I was like, wow. Yeah. Yeah. So it was, you know, it was completely a, different. Yeah. So that's mm -hmm. interesting that mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. I did see her as, in her mind, less is more. And in his mind, more is more. <laughs> <laughs> and um, it, it, it was hard for me to follow sometimes. Right. Yeah, the, me, yeah um, they, they both spoke very eloquently, <coughs> but she was more di direct. Yes. yes. Um, and succinct. Right. Which yes. is why her, her interview so only lasted. And she was the yeah. first time, too. Yeah. 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 She, was she was direct and specific with her answers. She was person. the, yes. I like it when speakers answer questions mm -hmm. directly and succinctly, but that's just a personal preference. But it's very to the point, mm -hmm. don't you think? Mm -hmm. But I think if. I felt more comfortable with him um, going for more of a, why don't you elaborate on that, or hope that he did, or was glad that some of us, you know, asked more questions. And it could have been the fact that he was number two, but I think it was his style was open to that. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like I have more um, experience after just two where I feel I wish she were here so I could ask I know. a few Again, more. I That's agree. How I that agree. Hers I, went too quickly. Yeah. yeah. She was didn't spend enough time with us and well we didn't that prompt is, as much yeah. and that's part of But he, he uh, didn't we, take he didn't need prompting. He didn't need prompting. He just, personality. Yeah, yeah, he just, just came on. He did yeah. ask her yeah. at the end if yeah. there was anything else she and, Right, and, and she did ask. She asked a couple of things and yeah. then she and you said you can stay. Right. Mm -hmm. and she didn't. Right. Mm -hmm. I mean, so those are choices that she made. Right. right. But I also think it comes down to your comfort level in terms of, like we said, one was succinct and one was more verbose, shall we say. Mm -hmm. um, it maybe just comes back to how comfortable you feel about that. I mean, it's like anything you could say, well, maybe she was kind of came across kind of shy or he was kind of gushy. You know, it's, mm -hmm. you can go to extremes with all That's of right. that. Right. That's right. Yes. Yeah. Well, they were two different extremes. Yes. <laughs> no, they did go to extremes. <laughs> and it comes they it becomes did. back to yeah. what personality yeah. type you feel, <clears throat> as say, works better with our situation. All right, let's move on to general then. Um, their responses on that. They were both, actually, I, um, Kimberly's response of how do you enter the library profession, that was, that was fun <laughs> of uh, merging of interests. Yeah, well, the elementary education degree, and then sitting yeah, across and saying, "I'm going to work there." Mm. That that was a, um, and Ryan, of course, not knowing. I mean, I didn't quite understand how the Nashua. I don't know how that library quite is set up, but he. He was involved from an early age. It was involved age. from an early yeah. age, and that's yeah. just what he wanted to do. Yeah. 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 And the grocery store didn't work. And the, go yeah. the grocery store didn't work. <laughs> it didn't work out. Um, I'd rather work in a library too. <laughs> well, and I thought they both had, you know, what attracted Hamilton Wenham. I think they both are aware that we are a regional library, and they appreciate that. And I think they're both ready for that challenge. I don't. That did not. I don't think that See, scared I, either of them. Yeah. Yeah. I, I'd agree with that. But I think he his it, part of the attraction for him was um, the location. He doesn't want to be out in Southboro in terms of his family. Right. Well, no, it's oh, still an hour away. Well, think, he told us. He said something about uh, That yeah, might have been in. with you guys, because I yeah. don't even know what she's no, talking no, about. No, it's like, yeah. it, I think he mentioned something tonight. But the actual he did mention something to him about, yeah. the, about being closer. Yeah. yeah. It's actually not closer, because it's Nashua, New Hampshire. But something. Either. Yeah. yeah. He looked location. Yeah. He was ready to look mm -hmm. in different locations. I think this is a community that he, I think he, feels he needs felt comfortable in. Yeah. yeah. 
And I think he was very attracted by the structure is absolutely beautiful and works. Right. And it was interesting because there were other candidates, too. I think we're so lucky. <laughs> there was one candidate who, the parking, actually a number of candidates, the parking was an issue. And um, so we're just very, we're so fortunate to have the library yeah. that we have. But so it's nice that that was, that is, I mean, who doesn't want to work on a beautiful and building? And a beautiful building. Yeah. yeah. And he's coming from such contrast. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. So, okay, so is it a draw for the general as well? I would, I think there is. I think they both have, I mean. They both do, coming from different yeah. positions. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, so going down to leadership skills and management abilities. I like both their answers. Different styles. Yeah. <laughs> His seems to be more collaborative, but he did say that, you know, basically the buck stops with me. Um, Which is true. Which is true. And his enthusiasm is infectious. That was a good one. Yeah, and it, it's true. And he did make us laugh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you are drawn to him as you, you uh, sort of want to. He did say that he likes to learn from his staff. So right. He listens to. Right, maximize <laughs> staff expertise <laughs> and strengths. But she said never ask a staff member to do what, you know, something you right. want to do. Right. Uh, a good listener. Lead good. by example, staff development and training. Should you talk about the workshops and training a little bit more than yeah, yeah, Ryan didn't it, really mm, talk he about didn't that. Touch about that. Didn't really talk no. About that. Mm -mm. Who knows if well, he has? He, she's sending them out for workshops and training, right? And he's talking about drawing on the expertise, knowledge, and abilities that they already have. Right. So I think it's inherent that they would keep up with. I mean, in today's world, you can't not keep up with mm -hmm. your staff development right. and your work. And training. Right. And his staff is so different. It seems it's very small. Like from ours yeah. or hers, mm -hmm. with positions not really, ex you know, on paper, not explained in the job right. position. He did talk about, yeah, he there. did talk about that one of the things, I'm pretty sure, I think I'm right, one of the things he did was to get a position of the job assistant position. director. Oh, yeah. No, he did, but oh. what he told us, he created, uh, he was able to fund, create and fund, which I think was a lot of why, I think that's just his, ba of just making the connections because that has been such a challenge, it appears in there, but that he funded the assistant director position, that there was no assistant director position when he started there. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's just been for a year. So, yeah, which is just sort of, you know, as just talking as to sort of, I think, why he, um, his thought process is the way it is, because he has worked so hard <laughs> to get this library, right, and that's not where we are. Um, but I think we have a very knowledgeable staff with a lot of expertise and abilities, and I think that someone who is able to draw on that and draw it out yes and set that forth in an interview as something that is important to him in his leadership mm -hmm. style is is important to the continued well-being of our library and the staff that already works there yeah and will also be something that will support him as he learns how the library works. I mean, we have an incredible staff that yeah. already, you know, that already work there. Right. And to have somebody who comes in and who, you know, lays that out as something that's important to him and can draw on that to create new programming or continue programming that's happened, expand programming, I think is an important. Mm -hmm. I did like his, his skill, yeah. as a director, as a leader. Right. He did talk about, and we didn't touch on it, and didn't really think about it till, and didn't touch on it, it with Kim, Kimberly either, of um, that he does the social media piece. Um, that it seems to be that that is, you know, he said he was tweeting about whatever he was, I can't remember what it was. The and pink library the, cards. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, that's something that, I mean, I, and Kimberly could do it too. I have no idea. We I didn't think, happen um, to ask that, but it, that is a nice thing. Yeah. 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 yeah, before. In her, right. In the last interview, she talked about how she 
has been somebody who's been working with the technology okay right? on that you know yeah. on social media right and trying to bring that um, to a different level and she did mention that she allows staff to be uh, let's see how do you energize this is number two under leadership she allows staff to be innovative in with projects to attain their goals right Right, along, right, number three, two, like right. Said, the yeah. Right, right. Okay. And she's worked in a lot of different areas of the library. And so, so she was the head of technical services, mm -hmm. and she oh, had that experience. Right. Um, she was in child in the children's services. She's the head right. of children. Head, and she was head of staff breakfast. librarian. So she's been in all different areas and, and, right. you know, in that library. I also get the impression that she's been in those areas consistently, whereas Ryan comes across, in my eyes, more of a firefighter. You know, he can step in, but her background is more consistent and more, yeah, more slightly deeper. I think she's been in a more structured library yeah. setting, too, yeah. where she can do that. Right. Yeah. I don't think his library setting is very structured. Um, and, that, at, at, and that leads me to question how would he do with would, all the structure would, that would, we have. Yeah, would, that be, would that be that too structured have. or does he thrive on the right. would he firefighting? Like, or take a breath of fresh air going, whew, okay, <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, interesting. Okay, trustees and town officials. I, I have no idea how the town officials would handle Ryan. Mm -hmm. I don't know what they think. And, and they're changing too. Uh, you know, we've right. got a new town manager in Hamilton, and right, actually, it's a good opportunity a new, for a yeah. Man, you know. But yeah. is, it, is it not a case of um, how he represents the library with the town right. officials rather than yes. how they handle him? Yeah, I think it's right. how he represents. I think he's very. I th yeah. I think he, if we needed something done, he would. I think he'd be really disappointed if he found out we didn't have a personnel department <laughs> <laughs> in either town. <laughs> he kept going back to that. I, I know. Thought, oh my God! I, I should I say something, but oh. <laughs> but he did. He, I he think went they back both have several times. Yeah, I think they both would be fine. It would do well, and I think oh, the expectations yeah. of the board. Um, I mean, um, Kim really said support the director. You know that we're biggest advocates for the community and he would want to know what are this is interesting too you know what our expectations are and what our goals are um, uh, interesting Kim did say you know helping them understand about the funding the state aid etc was very specific mm -hmm. about um, how we run how we are organized and what um, and Ryan was more broad as to how can the library sort of help you, um, you know, so it was a little bit of a different focus, not that it couldn't be, but actually in looking at Kimberly's response, I, you know, continuous, continuing to educate the... Right, advocating, educating. Yeah. Making sure the library stays on the front burner. Right. What were you thinking about, Dee? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, preface this with the fact that I know it's a snapshot, but uh, I'm going to compare two things. Um, she, um, oh, shows her face at, at events. And yeah. I mean, I, I think that's those words sound superficial, but that's not what she meant. I think she meant, you know, really wants to be involved in events and show the director cares. And um, a couple of times, this might be unfair, but a couple of times he seemed to have that, like, oh, I had to go to a morning meeting, I had to go to an evening yeah, meeting. It seems like mm -hmm. a little bit of a, mm -hmm. what, what? <laughs> a little bit of a yeah. But then I, you know, like yeah. I say, it's just a snapshot. Yeah. I did like that she did say, too, when she would just involve the library, that she's happy to also just be like a meet and greet, like, 
you know yeah. I like that she did say that and I did I I she um, she was very strong tonight in her um, in in her and I'm and just to be play devil's advocate again yeah. I'm going to say I thought Ryan was saying that he would do whatever it took to be where he needed to be yeah come in I do right exactly he did say that. exactly um, he did and I think and that he does you know, I think that. talking about that idea of you know what some days my job starts at eight o'clock in the morning and it goes until ten o'clock at night right and again I think thinking of that you know his passion for being at places and Oh, there's no being the, being the face of the library then. I think maybe what it comes down to, we're discussing around the fact that one would lead from the front and one leads from behind. Mm -hmm. You know, one is almost like perceived to be the face of the library, right. whereas the other one is perfectly willing to, not say stand in the shadows, but not be the face. Right. In your face. Mm -hmm. or, so. or be both. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, just gentler. Yeah. Right. And to be a good leader doesn't mean that you have to be out there in your face. I mean, sometimes a very good leader is the person who is back, yeah, quiet, taking a step back, absorbing, and then coming out with mm -hmm. an idea or decision. Okay. And I, so we'll talk about community outreach, and then I think we need to think for a it's couple minutes. It's quarter past and then just, seven. Yeah, yeah we're going we to have to decide whether we're going to make a decision tonight or not. Because yeah, I would somebody urge. Somebody else is coming into this table. Not till eight. Meeting. Oh, really? Yeah. Not till eight. But I do yeah. feel that yeah, I, th well, let's, so the community outreach, I think they're both, you know, again, I think they're just so similar and so different. <laughs> I, I mean, how, how do you compare community outreach with running around and getting strawberries for a strawberry festival when there's no strawberries? It was amazing. Because it was I, for I, the community. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I think that we, that maybe we'll go around and just, I mean, I, it doesn't mean we won't make a motion. We can just say what our gut says. And it's, again, I think both, all of us are saying we could go with either candidate and be very happy with them. They would be more than capable and we'd be lucky to have them in this position. Um, but we do have to decide one. Um, okay, do you want me to go first? Would you like to go first? Kim? I'm still conflicted. Uh, I, I'm gonna be conflicted on, yes. But, okay. but would you say which one? We can go around again and make a. It's this isn't a motion. This is just a. Oh, I know it's not. Yeah, I know it's not. And and I could go with either one of them. I know. I um, too, Judy. I guess I'm. I've still got to go with my feeling that that we're not broken. We don't need to be fixed. And I I think I would go with Kim. But I could change my mind quickly. No. <laughs> Again, I could change my mind very quickly. I'd have you do a paint at five or six times. <laughs> Nicole. I'm glad I'm not the only one who's gone. Oh my God, my stomach hurts. Oh, old. I think I, old. I, <laughs> feel better. So, uh, yeah. Um, I think I would say Ryan. You've had the luxury of having that. Yeah, yeah. so we can share that, and that's okay. We can share that. After listening to the two of them, they both 
really liked Ryan as well. And so I, you have to go, and not that they didn't like Kim, but that they didn't think that Ryan was going to come in and, you know, no. break apart what they have or force no. them to do anything. You know what I mean? They didn't right. see him as somebody no. who was coming in to change, to change. what they had. Okay. No. Right. I um, think that's, that's very that's, valuable. That's, and yeah, valuable. That's, that's good and information. He's for us. He's right. And yeah. I think yes. that... No, but he's working, but, but, but he, it's everybody. He's working for everybody, yeah. but, right. but I'm just saying, you know, I think we have... I think that I... Yeah. I think that Ryan... Do you want to keep going around the table? No, I'm just yes, saying. Yes, but I do. I, but I don't think that in any way either of the staff members who worked on the search committee felt that he was somebody who was going to come in and no, and no. And how, did they, the and how did they feel about her? Well, didn't well she didn't really. Either. She didn't really present as well as she presented tonight. So they might feel differently after. Okay. Yeah. After Kim you know, she presented after very her. strongly tonight. Yeah, tonight she presented she very differently than really. she did yeah. in her first interview. Because my concern was that she wasn't strong enough. Oh. Yeah. She came. So much that's stronger. Interesting this time. that yeah, you said that. She was much that. stronger tonight than she was oh. in her first interview. Because that was my one of my big hesitations with her. Is that she See, and I've just said that enough. he was dialed back tonight. Yeah, he was, he was dialed back because he, he was, was tired. Very, kind of, yeah, he, was he was tired, and he had been tired. sick. He had been sick for yeah. a week. Yeah, I mean, I, I you so know, he was Didi, in, back in compared well, to his in talk in what you were saying too, I think that's one of my biggest conflicts is that I think. As you said, you know, a little bit less risk adverse. Not that having Ryan is risky, but Ryan's personality is just very different yeah, than what we've different. had. Mm -hmm. And Kim is more of the same. And, you know, partly to your point, well, why are we upsetting the apple cart? Yeah. On the yeah. other, and the other is, well, you know, the apple cart is where it is. We didn't, we, we, we didn't, you know, we, we were very happy with our with our <laughs> but, apple cart, with our apple cart. <laughs> but cha but it's you know that's done yeah. it's done Ooh. so now there is an opportunity that just happened to present itself that um, and I, I yeah and to to um, Nicole's point the staff was very not worried about that at all okay that but was then not again, yeah taking it a step back before the interviews. She was in the top, she was consistently in the top ranks for people we'd interview, whereas he was an outsider. You remember that? What do you mean by an outsider? I don't well, we had, you know, we had uh, 11 to choose from uh -huh. to decide how many we interview, and we kind of did our top three or four, and we worked out who was all, like, event, if somebody was in 10 people's top, they, they, they were in the top. He wasn't in everybody's top. She was more slanted towards that but that was simply looking at them on paper right but then after the first interview he was in yeah consistently in everybody's time yeah but that yeah but i think that in that instance you're correct except that more information was provided so it wasn't just based on just looking at yeah. at and and the the reason uh, a lot of the reasons too were because the others people were directors so it was like well we'll go to the directors versus the assistant director so mm. okay, okay. yeah I mean just yeah no no okay. good yeah and Dolores yeah. Uh, well what you said about the staff sort of swayed me back towards Ryan me too yeah me too but there's something about Kim She's willing to take this big step, and it's a big step. Even though she's the assistant, it's a big step. She, in her heart, in her mind, she knows she's ready. And I think she's going to come in. She would come in, and um, she'd do a great job. I think it she'd do a great job. I think I worry a little. You know, when, when she first started, I thought, oh, she's a little shy, and but. Again, that doesn't mean anything. Just see, um, I. This would be a hard interview. This, <laughs> it's hard to be in that position and exactly. interview with. Yeah. And I thought she conducted yeah. herself. But I think she was relaxed. Relaxed. Yes. Maybe not. She. I think you could say shy, but she was a woman of fewer words. Mm -hmm. But she seemed content with her answers. 
she seemed confident and relaxed to me. Yeah. So right now, we have... And what are your thoughts? <laughs> <laughs> My thoughts are that Kim would be more of a, would be, she would do a wonderful job. Um, and it, it, it was, it, she'd be more behind the scenes, but I think she can be out in front as well. Um, and Ryan, I think Ryan would do a wonderful job as well. I think that he's been in a different, I think he's more than capable. And I think his personality may be Sort of fun. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, he made it. You know, more of fun. Sort of fun. Um, I think that he can be. You know, if we needed to have, you know, to your point, Dee Dee, just of being okay. The, this is what we need to have happen. You know, succinct and to the point. That I think he can be, um, if, from a public speaking standpoint. Um, but I think he is a natural storyteller. I think he's a natural people person. I mm -hmm. think that's who it is. Mm -hmm. He did talk about in his first interview how he has to give a five minute. Oh right. Speech yes, and he keeps it, and he's yeah, he did. And he has to practice it and practice it and practice it so he can keep it at five minutes. Yeah, <laughs> because he only yes, has, he only that's has so true. When he has to speak in front of the town yeah. at town meeting yeah. for the one town meeting day like at other times I'm sure he's very verbose but um, and how he has to really practice that and hold himself to in, five in check because he gets five minutes right. but he does it but he does it but he does it yeah um, and I bet everybody in the town knows him it's not a bad thing. No, no, I, I, I mean yeah. that in a positive yeah. way. I mean, that's not a bad thing. That's, that's a good thing. So she would just kind of blend into the, mm -hmm. and be, into the background. No, I don't know if she Not in a bad no, way. I don't think so. I don't think so. No. But it's interesting that you said she was strong tonight because that she was my stronger. one concern was that she, was she stronger wasn't strong tonight. enough. Stronger yeah. tonight than okay. she was. All right, um, let's go around one more time. <sighs> We got to decide because decide coming back next week is not going to help. No. No, Does anybody not. change their vote? Mm -hmm. Do you, are you? No. You're the. No. I'm going to stay with Kim. Kim, are you staying with Kim? Are you staying with Ryan? Okay. And I go back and forth. I think I'd go back with Ryan this time. Kim. Yeah, and I would go back with Ryan. We're hung jury. So we're oh, you've hung. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, jeez. We're six of us. Oh. Um, this is where we get the dice out. I know. <laughs> no, a coin. Uh, I'm not sure what happens when we're. No, I think we. I mean, we still have another half hour. I mean, I could switch to Kim. And I, I could, could switch. Too. And I could switch to Ryan. Yeah, I, mean, I could. I, I guess I'm sort of thinking one thing is that this is an opportunity for, again, we weren't looking for it, but it's, it, this director would be very different than our last director. And, and our, you know, we adore our director, but, but that's done. So, you know, to your point, do we want more of the same, which has been fabulous? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know why rock the boat? On the other hand, and it's not rocking the boat because I don't think Ryan would rock the boat. I just I think that say, but his in his. We don't know what they're going to do. We don't you know what either. None of them would do. No, no you're right. we're just basing it on almost know. like personality style. Exactly. Yes. One is more low key. One is more flamboyant. Right. One is more behind the scenes. One is more front and center. Right. What is the style that we want to go with? What is the best fit for our library and our patrons and our community? Well, I, f I mean, clearly the style that we have had has been extraordinarily successful. Mm -hmm. I don't know any other style. 
Right. And it's right. well, neither do I, but it's yeah. been. Ex- but yeah. we know that it's we don't been know any other style. Yeah. We know that it's been very successful, and it's. I mean, we we are our, our library. When I go to the finance committee, it's buttoned up. It's mm-hmm. just thank you and thank you for having such a wonderful resource, mm-hmm. and it's it's to the point and it's you know the standards are set high. Yeah, yeah. very high. I, yes. what, one of the things I've noticed about Jan is Jan comes across as you know she's quiet, she's very she's gentle. gentle. But a couple of times she has said in meetings, this is the way it's going to be. And she goes and yes. talks to yes. the boards and she goes, she knows. Right. She, and she gets it done. Yes. Think, oh, wow. She. The box stops with her? Yes. Right. And so. And that's what concerns me about Kim. Kim, me too. What she that's, be? Yes, as I say yeah. that, I that, think that. Yeah. Yeah, I that's think what that. concerns me. I mean, me. you don't, you know. You and she's got two towns, too, that she's got to deal with. See, I've got to be honest, that concerns me about Ryan, because I can, my impression is a little bit blowing in the wind. I, I'm with you, Dorothy. I think, I think Kim would be able to. I think Kim I think is, a, to. I think she would be able to. I think that her personality, I'm just guess again. Well, it's the snapshot is what we have. It's a guessing game. But I You're think right. that it's, 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 it, and especially actually the difference of what I saw last time and this time is that I think that she came um, strong and that she would be, uh, I think she would be able to go and make her case very succinctly and eloquently and get it done. And, and, and maybe this isn't a reason to hire somebody but here's someone that's at the brink of her career. Right. And she's going to prove herself. Prove herself. And, and in my heart, I say to myself, wouldn't it be nice if I could give her that opportunity I totally to move up? I mean, I'm, now I'm coming at it more of a, a compassionate yeah. way. Yeah, you're showing more emotion. emotion. But how can you keep that up if you want? You're hard. staying with Ryan. He's at the are you? of his career. Right. So yeah. I mean, I think. Too. Yeah. I, I mean, think my gut says too. they're both at about the same age. I think when when I tried to look at the, so the well. resumes and figure it out, I think they're yes, both I about the same. Yeah. Age. yeah. I looked at their graduation yeah. dates yeah. and yeah. 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 So I think I they're, both, well. they're both. They're both. I try to picture a meeting with each of them. Mm-hmm. A board of trustees right. meeting. Right. <clears throat> um, and I think. And I do feel like uh, it would go from 6.30 to 7.30 better with Kim. And with, you know, just a little bit of, okay, forward motion yeah. you know, rather than going this way. And, um, but I must say that I think the friends of, of, of um, the library would enjoy him. <laughs> <laughs> They're different personalities. Right. Okay, so you're staying hard with Kim. Mm-hmm. You're staying hard with Ryan. I mean, again, we. Can, I mean, but once I think we decide which one, then I think we'll do. Uh, then we'll do a vote, and we'll. We know majority rules, so I think it would. We can vote the way we would like, but I think that once the motion is made and we vote, then it would be nice, since to support whichever candidate with a unanimous just because I think oh, all I, of us I feel that way. Probably agree with yeah, that. I think we could do that yeah, on absolutely. either way. Absolutely. Um, okay, you're sticking. What are you doing? I could go either way. I really could. Okay, mm-hmm. you're sticking with Ryan. You're sticking with Kimberly. You're sticking with Kimberly. I didn't hear what Judy said. I could go either way. Did. I she, really, I've fluctuated back and forth. I have too. I have two. We're not and very I, decisive, are we? <laughs> well, no, because I think they're I, I both just, just yeah. and, I, and, and they both have different things to give. Right. But I guess what I, the way I feel is that three of feel strongly for one candidate, one feels strongly for the other. You and I could go either. I mean, I, I think everybody can go either yeah. way. That's yeah. not, f- mm-hmm. that's very so evident. Whatever, whatever decision comes out tonight, we're going to win. Yes. That's yes. True. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh, we've been delivering <laughs> we for an hour. We, we need to do yeah, it. We need to I'm do it 
clear um, the table for the I next think it's group. Spe I think it's clear that um, that either are going to go, but that the majority are for Kim. Because I can go either way and the standstill. And I, I feel that you and I can go either way. Mm -hmm. And not that everyone can't either, yeah. but that you're we pretty darn, yeah, yeah. of course you would, and you, but you're pretty you strong. you the whole time. And yes, and and whereas we have not. Yeah. <laughs> so, are you staying, okay. All right, then. Um, the way I'm seeing it is if it sounds like you're gonna announce Nate For Kim, yeah. Slightly in her corner. Right, something because it is a condition. Right. right, very, yeah, very right, right, right. Yeah. And never refer to him as Plan B again. Yeah, no, <laughs> no, and I think and that. And you just planted it. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me, I think, you know, how lucky are we to have these two fabulous choices and to go back and forth? And I think that the library will be in good hands in either way. Um, but I think it's time to make a decision, and I think the majority, I think the fact that three people are hard on Kim, you and I can go either way, you're hard on Ryan, that's, you know, it just seems. So, um, I move that we make a conditional offer of employment subject to reference checks and contract negotiations to Kimberly Butler. I'll second that. Um, okay. Then it is moved and seconded that a conditional offer of employment subject to reference checks and contract negotiations be made to Kim Butler. And do you want to vote? Yeah. All in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? All right. Thank you. <laughs>